All right, hello YouTube and uh, YouTube subscribers. Uh, looks like I'm taking another step in fish keeping, and that is the keep eating of invertebrates. So um, I went out today. I picked up four red cherry shrimp, and this guy here. This guy here, he's not a red cherry shrimp. I think he's actually a uh, uh, what the heck, a red glass shrimp or something like that. So I picked up four red cherry shrimp, trying them out. Can't really get a good focus on them because you know they're tiny. Well, they're actually bigger than the scrout base, but they're pretty tiny. So there's four of them in here. They seem to be doing them pretty good. In fact, I can actually see all four of them right now. And they're all just kind of... I put some fish food in. They're kind of scurrying around the bottom looking for fish food. And uh, actually, to be honest with you, over the past two weeks, I've actually gotten way more interested in invertebrates right now. I'm thinking that when I go back home and I work, I might save up some money. Is And what I think I'm going to do is... I'm going to replace one of these tanks and then probably give away one of these or sell it and I'm going to replace one of them with a 30 gallon and I think what might happen is the like, members of this tank will get moved into here and then the members of the 10 gallon will get moved into a 30 gallon and I want to turn the 30 gallon, the 10 gallon tank into a, like scarlet baddis, some fancy snails, some fancy shrimp and all that look kind of cool may replace both these tanks with, say, 30 gallons, but that's kind of pushing it, so I've got that much space. So, uh, I'm going to do some research on these guys. Well, actually, I did plenty of research on them before I buy them. I always say, research before you buy. It helps you win every time. And one thing about this tank is I don't really seem to care about how this tank looks. I think this is easily the ugliest tank I have in terms of, like, just as, it's just unorganized, like all my other aquariums. But I think I'm going to try to fix this one up a bit, maybe. I don't care how it looks that much, like how it looks right now, just because it's uh, functioning very well. It's uh, almost like there's like a natural food supply in there for a scarlet baddis. But there probably isn't going to be any more now, because that they're competing with the shrimp. And it just looks pretty not that impressive. But Oh, one kind of interesting thing today is, when you ever buy shrimp, a pet shop, and if the person who's selling you shrimp is uh, well versed in keeping shrimp, he sh he'll put something in the bag for the shrimp to crawl on. Because interestingly, if these guys uh, don't move around, they like their blood doesn't like circulate properly, and they die. So um, this guy he threw in this moss, and originally I thought it was drop moss, but it might actually be a piece of Christmas moss. And I like Christmas moss more than drop moss. So hopefully I did get some Christmas moss. So thanks for watching. Please rate, comment, and subscribe.